Welcome back to Elm Riders. A couple of things quickly before we even jump into this video. It is so important to make sure you were doing this. When you are farming for legendaries and you're doing it solo, make sure you press down on your D-pad to auto loot as leaving the game will not pick up the stuff for you. When you're playing co-op, you can simply just return to lobby with your squad and it picks up everything with the auto loot feature. If you're playing solo for some reason that doesn't work, just simply press down on your D-pad, it'll do the same thing. But there's an extra button you have to press before you return to the lobby. Another thing I've noticed is the loot actually seems to be much better when you're playing in a group. So go through YouTube comments, go through Discords, like servers and stuff. Any way you can to find a group that will want to farm with you, make sure you do that because the loot seems to be so much better. When I'm running in a group, I typically get, I don't know, say at least like three blues on the run. There are a lot of blues that come out of the chests when I'm playing in a three player group, but when I've run this solo, I'm pretty much just getting all greens. When I've been doing this chest run, the five chests, I haven't had a single legendary. Bear in mind, I haven't done it for long. Like, I haven't done it for long at all, but I've had mostly greens. So if possible, group up. Make sure you are using the auto loot feature being down on the D-pad if you're solo. If you're in a group, it doesn't matter. Don't forget to go into the game settings and set your auto loot minimum rarity. If you set it to unusual, anything green and above will be automatically looted. If you set it to rare, anything blue and above will be automatically looted. So it was just a simple, just really quick video to explain that it's a big, big problem. Like, make sure if you're doing anything solo and you want to auto loot, it's down on the D-pad because I didn't know I did several runs. If I had a legendary and I left it there and I just returned to lobby, didn't press down on my D-pad in so like whilst I was playing solo, I would have lost it. Another thing I'd really like to see in this game just quickly before we wrap the video up, they need to add in a feature so that we can lock up the gear that we want to keep. Something like a save as favourite, mark as favourite sort of thing. So that way people don't accidentally go and deconstruct the legendary. Because it, I've seen it happen a lot of times in several different like looter shooter games. People just aren't marking their stuff as favourite, there's no option to do it or something like that. And they're accidentally deconstructing some of the best stuff in the game. But on that note, that's going to do it for the video. Let me know your thoughts and stuff in the comments. I will see you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it helped you out.